Welcome back or hello, whichever one it may or may not be. Whichever one it is, oh well, who cares? But again, it's the all terrain ties only mud runner challenge, and I should have gotten my pillow so I don't have to sit weird here. Crap! It's right over there, see? Totally prepared! Totally prepared for this! <laughs> totally remember to be prepared for this. Okay, did hit my time. <laughs> Well, last episode, we ended with me up on a hill, unsurprisingly. So now, we're gonna go probably, hmm, thinking about going up to towers. Yeah, let's go up to this tower. Uh, uh, how much of this map do I remember? If I remember it, this will go, I think, to it, pretty much. Yeah, let's go. Let's go that way, that should get me to it. Hopefully, I hope it does. If it doesn't, then... Well, fuck it. I don't know. I'll figure it out. <laughs> oh, wait. Isn't there a bridge over there that's knocked down or something like that? That might be true. <laughs> you can tell I've played this game enough just because I remember where that crap stuff is. <laughs> Uh, let's see, the Scout 800 is on this map, too, but... Uh, Scout 800 is kind of meh. Granted, it's, a, it's another international, seriously. But, eh. If I remember right, the Scout 800 was... International's attempt to compete with the Jeep, if I remember right. Or they just wanted to make an off-road vehicle for whatever reason. International's weird. Let's see, International makes tractors, they make tractor trailers, it's a semi by the way. They make jeeps. I wonder if they make cars. <laughs> I'm kinda curious. Does International make cars? I should look that up sometime. <laughs> Cause I'm kinda curious if they do or not. <laughs> That'll be funny if they actually do make cars. If International actually makes cars, that would actually be kinda funny. I wish you could carry, or buy one of those fuel trailers, that, that fuel trailer over there. I wish you could buy one of those and carry one, just because it would be fun. <laughs> I really wish you could. It would be very entertaining. What is this tax? Uh, is this a drown? Yeah, it's a drown trailer. Uh, That music is probably what's your crap, but I don't care enough. Machinery. Uh, drowned. Scout truck. Missing oil tanker, that's what it is. Oh yeah, you have to actually track them here now, which is weird enough as it is. I wonder if this is a copyright song, but it is, I don't care. Hmm. Where is it? Holy crap, that's far away. I'm not gonna have any time soon. <laughs> I'm not getting that. Oh, isn't that one in Swamp, too? Yeah, I'm not getting that any time soon. <laughs> I'm gonna need, what, two trucks to get that? Probably. <laughs> oh, probably am. Let's see. Probably that Fleet Star International is probably what I'm using. I'm probably gonna end up needing two of them too. Or I'm gonna end up using the Chevy and the Fleet Star. Hmm. Well, that'll be interesting when it comes. I was right, there's a bridge here. Tag those in stacks, it's more important. I hit the wrong button. Yeah, this is more important. <laughs> it really is. Oh, it does. There's a road going on to it over here. I did remember partly correctly. Kind of. Eh, for a second. I was kind of right. <laughs> I got to the place where I needed to go at least. 
<laughs> it's all that really matters, right? Boing. Uh. Mm -hmm. Boing. There's the watchtower. Oh, it's raining. Even though it looks very sunny. Granted, that can happen in a lot of places. Especially Missouri, where it's partly raining one spot and partly not raining in another. <laughs> oh, that's a lot of parts of Missouri in a nutshell. Let's see. Eh, I can go around and get to it. Because these watchtowers are, like, what are they? They're towers for... Oh, what are their names? National Park. So, like, National Park. Uh... I can't think of the name! It's like, National Park Guard Towers. I don't... I can't think of the name for some stupid reason, and it's kind of annoying me. Hmm. Oh, well. Ranger Towers! There we go! The Ranger Towers! They're the National Guard Ranger... National Guard. They're the National Park Guard Ranger Towers. There we go! <laughs> I think it's the Model F2. That's probably what they are. Come on, Jimmy! It's only a little bit of mud. You're fine. Your tires are rated good for mud! You should be fine! Why is there a thing over there? Whatever. I don't think I need four-wheel drive on anymore. I feel like I turn better with four-wheel drive. <laughs> uh, probably do, too. Oh, well. Don't hit the rock. Don't hit the rock. Good job, I didn't hit the rock. I did it. Oh, I didn't hit the rock. Oh, it's technically over that. You know what? That's a little exciting. Let's be a little exciting to drive up this, even though I know it's not up there and I'm gonna have to drive down towards it. Oh. Uh. The heck is that thing? Seriously, the heck is that thing? Is it an antenna? It looks like it's like an antenna. This game needs like actual just like music from artists and stuff, because it's very boring. <laughs> the ambiance of music in this game is very boring. <laughs> hmm, oh, it's a Chevy Kodiak. If I remember right, if I just go up near that, I can get it. No, oh, let's go get that upgrade part. Probably need it. I'm probably gonna need it eventually. What level am I? I'm still level two, and I'm not getting level three anytime soon. Too much of it. But if I did some contracts or some tasks, I probably would be fine and actually level up and stuff. But screw it. <laughs> uh, how the heck do I get to that? Let's see if I remember. I think I can go down this little route, kind of route, little slide, mud slide place over here, if I remember right. Maybe? Maybe? Let's find it. Aww, I'm not gonna be able to use the Hummer for this. Aww, I just realized that. I like the Hummer, it's fun. It's a fun scout vehicle. That's really it. It's just fun. Curse you, Alaskan map! Oh. I do get to use the White Western Star, which is... Basically my favorite truck. Basically my favorite truck. I got a Freightliner. There's... What is it? It's an off-road or the heavy? I don't remember which. It's either the off-road or the heavy. There's, there's two Freightliners in this game. There's a military one, and then just this regular... Regular Freightliner. If I remember right, <laughs> the Freightliner that's just the regular Freightliner is pretty much just a White Western Star. 
I think it's just taller. <laughs> just funny in and of itself. Alright, what I get? You get anything interesting? There it is. I got a bigger engine. Eh, that'll come in handy. Let's get that Chevy Kodiak. Kodiak is a weird ass truck. If I remember right, the Kodiak, well, the Kodiak does have an actual full size truck engine, and the S750 doesn't, which is really entertaining enough as it is. It's just surprising they didn't put a full size truck engine. I don't think they did that until like the 80s, if I remember right. They didn't do that until the 80s ish. But, eh, Ford's weird. Great that I'm still a Ford person, but Ford's weird. All truck companies are weird. They all have their weird models of vehicles. <laughs> Great that I believe the Chevy Kodiak was meant to be a full size truck, and the F750 was meant to be a full size, a mix between a full size truck and a pickup. I think that's what the S750's goal was originally. Now, if I remember right, the F750 is a full size truck! <laughs> What I mean by a full-size truck is what I, is I mean, I mean a semi-truck for Americans, for Australians, it's just a truck and not a ute, which is what people in Australia call pickups, for anybody who doesn't know. In Australia, they call pickups utes, if I remember right. And they just call a truck a truck, but I call a semi-truck a truck, so. <laughs> hey, we should've just went down that road. Oh, well. Ew. And in America, we also call semi-trucks tractor trailers, but that does actually make sense. And 16 wheels, because they have 16 wheels with certain trailers. <laughs> How many wheels? You can have a lot of wheels on trailers, by the way. <laughs> you can have a lot! Especially if you're carrying triples or doubles. If you didn't know, there are semis that are, well, they have, they have long trailers, they have short trailers, and they have oversized trailers. Long trailer, short trailers, you can carry up to three of them legally in most states, in some states. I know you can, oh, what states, I don't remember, I don't know if you can carry, legally carry three trailers in Colorado, but, yes, you can actually carry three trailers on one semi. <laughs> So, and how you do, and how they do that is, is you have a dolly, you have what's called a dolly, for people who don't know. A dolly is basically just a fifth wheel with a wheel, with wheels on it. A fifth wheel is a hitch. Uh, well, fifth wheels are kind of hitch, for anybody uninitiated running trucks, which is fine. Which is fine, you don't have to be initiated to know what a fifth wheel is, I can show what a fifth wheel is on this. This is a fifth wheel. The thing they call a saddle in this game is called a fifth wheel. Calling it a saddle is actually correct too, but it's 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 a fifth wheel. Anyway, let's sell this truck because I'm never gonna use it. <laughs> I'm never gonna use it. Speaking of which, let's buy a foot. No, I'm kidding. <laughs> Tires gonna get for you. Curious. I think you work as soon as the same as the tr normal trucks do. Well, no, actually, you can get those in six. Hm. Sadly, the, the bigger tires I can't get. I'd have to get the smaller ones, which is fine, honestly. 35s aren't the best, but they work fine since the since this is in Alaska. I don't really need a service truck, because pretty much what this thing would be. It'd just be a service truck. Even though this is actually a fire rescue body. If I remember right, this is actually a fire rescue body. Which is actually entertaining, because if I remember right, you can put a flash on it, too. <laughs> oh, I might get that, but I might just save it for this. Since... Yeah. It's just a bigger, better truck. Honestly. 
It's bigger, it's better, and it's higher up off the ground. <laughs> what else is there to say? Oh, and this is in Alaska, too. I don't think I've ever found that. Considering, I believe you can actually put the wicker tires on it without even... Yeah, you can. You can put the big... Yeah, it only has 46. 46 inch tire, so... Hmm. What would be better? Doing the singles? Well, there's more rubber on the ground, so yeah, it'd be better to do this. Eh. Yeah, don't need to sing like... Wow, you can just... Just get the spare tire now! What is this magic? <laughs> I have used this truck like once, hilariously. <laughs> I'm not even kidding, I've actually used this truck. You can raise it? <laughs> what? <laughs> I didn't know that! <laughs> you can raise this truck? <laughs> what? I'm sorry, that is just awesome, but you can race this truck! <laughs> Holy crap, you can get a giant snorkel on this thing too! <laughs> I'm just messing around right now if you can't tell, but... There's a lot of things you need to do with this that I didn't know. Can we get forward drive for this truck now? <laughs> Even though, the four-wheel drive for this truck is really annoying. So, okay, I'm just going to show you it. There's no drive axle! There's no drive axle! WHY IS THERE NO DRIVE AXLE?! <sighs> if you're curious, I can show what a drive axle is. I think I, I think I can show it on this truck, kind of. Uh, I think the Chevy shows it better. Oh, uh, the Chevy probably shows it better. Oh, well, I'll show you what a drive axle is later, but... That truck doesn't have a drive axle, it's just putting power to nothing! That annoys the ever-living crap out of me. Why did they not make it a drive axle? Why? It needs to have a drive axle to actually have power to the front wheels! Ah! So annoying! <laughs> Granted, there are a lot of little nitpicks for this game that are annoying. <laughs> so, whatever. Like the F750! It doesn't have a V6, it has a V8! And it's not a diesel. It'd still be underpowered, which is fine! I just put the right engine in the truck. <laughs> uh, I wish I just would've put the right engine in the truck. That's that's really all I care, I just wish you would've put the right engine in the truck. Alright, well, let's go get that tower. I heard that doesn't say it's a cat or a Volvo. It's just a excavator. Hmm. Hmm. Every time I think of one of those, I think of the goddamn... Oh, what is it? Is it Animation Versus? Oh, what is this guy's name? I don't remember his name. I can't remember his name right now. This is Animator, who has an animation series, whatever. But... <laughs> his little animation people were doing a challenge, a Minecraft thing. It's, it's very entertaining and very cute, but... What are the- they're making an excavator like one of those, and it was a cat model. <laughs> I don't know why this is so cute, but since you can have cats in Minecraft, one of the little stick figure things, stick figure animation guys, he put a cat on top of one of his excavator because it was a cat uh, excavator, which is just adorable. <laughs> Ah, uh, it was very entertaining. I don't remember his name, and it kind of makes me mad, but it's his Animation First series? And I believe it was Animation vs. Minecraft, it was one of those. Right, I need to go the other way. These animations are family friendly. And they're very adorable. <laughs> <laughs> Coming from somebody who actually plays Minecraft every now and then. <laughs> it's amazing what you can, what kind of character development you can show through animations that don't show emotion, that don't really have faces and don't speak. It is very cool how you can do that. You can show a emotion and b 
kind of character development. And just personality, that's what I should say. You can show personality. <laughs> it's a very... It's really cool. Some people can do that. Speaking of animators, what's her name? Jane Animations? I think it's Jane Animations. I got into her recently. Her stories and animations are pretty entertaining and her animations are pretty decent. <laughs> well, I shouldn't say they're decent because I don't know how the hell to animate, so I shouldn't be speaking about that. <laughs> <laughs> Granted, if I remember animation... Well, doing animations isn't hard. Making them good is very difficult. <laughs> Making them A, high quality, and B, good is very difficult. But just to animate something to walk? I remember right? It's too difficult if you're making like a sick figure do it. I'm pretty sure it's doing. Or just making something go one from here, one from here. Alright, let's look over it. I can show you what a drive axle is. Okay, so. Maybe I can show what a drive axle is. Maybe I can show what a drive axle is. <laughs> or a front facing drive axle is. Maybe. I don't know for sure or not. Actually, does this thing have a fucking drive axle? This thing doesn't have a goddamn drive axle! I'm face palming so hard right now. <laughs> okay. The fuck? This thing doesn't have a custom driver. Okay, so a driver axle, you see in the back. You'd have one of those in the front. How it has your. I'm blanking. I'm blanking on what it is. But whatever. It, that's, that goes from your. This little thing would have a. Uh, God damn it, I'm blanking on everything! I forgot what the thing's called, but it would have this box in the middle of it that would have... Those drive shafts, there we go. That little rod going to the back. That little... I, I don't know why I'm pointing, but... That rod that's underneath your... That's underneath your truck. That going to the back, going to your uh, axles. Going to your two, two back axles. That rod. That rod is called the drive shaft. That drive shaft would go to a box. I forgot what the box is called, but not your transmission. And I'm not and I'm not talking about your transmission. This is something different. You would have a drive shaft from your transmission going to this box, then that box would have two to other drive shafts going to the back and the front. This thing does not have that, and it's really annoying. <laughs> I can see that now. Do you have a drive axle? <laughs> you do have a drive axle, actually, I think. I forgot what the box is called. It looks like a transfer. This thing, you can see it on here. This, the box that I'm talking about. That thing right there. That has three drive shafts on it. That's what I'm talking about. This thing has it, but... Ah, uh, can I just, like, play with the racing and check? There, there we go. So, you see how it's straight on there? You, you can kind of tell, but it has a straight thing on there. That's a drive axle. This doesn't have one, and this doesn't have one either. Which is another thing I can go rant, go rant about for like an hour, but... <sighs> yeah, I just noticed this thing does not have a drive axle in the front. So this thing would only be back-wheel drive, rear-wheel drive. It could not be four-wheel drive. Is it called a transfer box? I don't remember. I don't know what the box is called. Granted, don't take me for an official... Oh, yeah, there's a part down there. I know what we're doing! Is that called a transfer box? A transfer case? I... Fuck, what is it called? It's annoying me. Because I should know what this is. Cause I, sh I should know what it is, and that's what's annoying me. I don't remember what it is. But yeah, this thing should only be back we have drive, because it doesn't have a drive. So I never realized that. The entire time I played this game, I never realized that. Hmm. That is interesting. Hmm. 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 I'm not gonna be sick with from Dark Souls. <laughs> 
I should be Sigurd from Dark Souls. I'd be the best voice actor for it. Hmm. 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 <laughs> I just noticed there's another freaking marker there. I put those down all the damn time. <laughs> I actually didn't do that all the damn time. I used to drive on a trail where there's mud and ruts and all that when you just drive on the grass. Perfectly fine. Okay. How am I gonna get to you? <laughs> How am I gonna get to that lovely little piece? And if you're running why I didn't stop for gas, I probably don't need it. At least this thing doesn't spit out black like a diesel. Considering it should considering this thing's also gas. Actually I think it's five liter engine, it's actually diesel. So if it did then I think it'd be fine. I think it is. I I think I could be very wrong. It's a 5.2 liter, so it might just be a gas. Oh. Oh well, I could bitch about this game for its weird little inequality slash mess up such minor detail thing, but at the very least the game's functional. And it's fun, so that's what really matters, but... Come on, guys, do your research into the trucks. That, or they couldn't actually put it... Put the drive axle on here that Chevy mandated that they couldn't for some weird reason. But they said it could be four-wheel drive. So... <laughs> I don't know. If you wonder why you don't have a drive axle on every... Or an axle like that on... Like a drive axle on every car, because it a a drive axle way more, like a lot more, and b it costs more drag on your car, so it's actually good to not have a big drive axle everywhere on your car, or just have one like normal cars. <laughs> That's like normal rear wheel or front wheel drive cars. Is that? I'm slightly mechanically inclined, if you can't tell. Slightly. <laughs> Not completely, just slightly. <laughs> Granted, if I get super YouTube famous, I'll do this to a truck. <laughs> oh, it's an owner thing. It's an owner transmission that I'm never gonna use. Because I don't have differential lock and I don't need it yet. <laughs> Oh, I should probably go get that and get the scouted hundred. Betting on that. You know what? Let's get that mountain bridge fixed. I need... What do we need for that? Mountain bridge. What am I going to need for that? It does not tell me. If I remember right, there's two different parts to that. No, Chevy or International. But, well, you know what? Let's use the Chevy, because why not? I mean, the, not the Chevy, though. This is basically Chevy, though, so. <laughs> this thing. Please start, there we go. Actually, wait. Wait, 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 yeah, I'm gonna have to do that first. <laughs> Kish, damn it, darn it, fuck it, damn it. I don't know why I did that. Now this thing's technically already four-wheel drive, just because the back act, just because the back tires is technically already four-wheel drive. 
Which it is already for it, I so this. So there is that, but... Eh, it's been, since it's already gone on for like 30 minutes. That's gonna be a thumbnail right there! <laughs> I swear I get the, every episode thumbnail right at the end, but... I hope you enjoyed, like, comment, subscribe, all that weird bullshit. I hope you join me again. Next time I'm gonna do more of this... All wheel, or all terrain tires on there, which I'm already hitting myself for. But bye bye. And join me next time.